Hello everyone, this is Ron from High Tech Legion and this is part of our review of the ASUS HD 7770 Direct CU video card. And this is the part of our review where we take a look at the overclocking uh, capabilities of this video card. And we are using, of course, the ASUS GPU Tweak Utility. You might have seen us first on our uh, ASUS Matrix GTX 580 Platinum review. It was a Republic of Gamers card, but this GPU Tweak Utility replaced a Smart Doctor as, of course, the overclocking utility for ASUS video cards. And uh, a lot more, it's a lot, it has a lot more features and more intuitive layout. And right now, I am actually in the advanced mode. Uh, for GP tweak, so we can uh, tweak our our overclock higher than 1,100 megahertz if you want to use that. And uh, we're also in this video we are going to test the fan noise as well. So uh, actually, uh, uh, we just mentioned that right now as you can see 10% fan speed and it's very quiet. Although the case I used was the NZXT H2, which is already a, a quiet, designed to be a quiet case. Um, and I'm just going to minimize the case fans right now, just so. Make sure that uh, you, when when you do the uh, fan compression, you don't uh, uh, you actually hear the card. But uh, generally, it does when you may, if you're going to overclock without touching the voltage, you don't need uh, to. Uh, I wouldn't suggest. I, w I could. I could. You could just leave it to auto. It won't matter because actually, the with just the default voltage, it, the highest the fans we got was 33 percent. So. That is very good and still very quiet because once you reach 40% typically, that's when you can hear it more, uh, become more audible. But of course, if you're going to overclock beyond 1,100 megahertz, I would suggest uh, without voltage addition, I, actually the highest I've achieved was 1,115, which is about uh, 5 megahertz shy of uh, the top version of the HD 7770 DCU, or direct CU uh, video card. And... Uh, course for maximum voltage is 1.35 you can just move this slide right here and of course to enable that uh, let me just show what the advanced setting is see here, there, here this button right here at the bottom is advanced well this is what you're going to see by default when you after you install the ASUS GPU tweak it just has the CPU clock memory clock and fan speed but once you have that you can see the GPU voltage as well you have access to that and of course you go to the settings and then there's more options in here for tuning you have to check this box that says overclocking range enhancement because uh, if you don't if you don't uh, tick that box the GPU clock can only go all the way uh, if you tick that it goes as you can see it goes all the way to 1000 uh, 2040 but if you don't that the range is only up to 1100 so that is a very uh, useful feature to have if you're only going to overclock beyond 1100 so the actually the safest the highest I've achieved was let me just load this profile here oh, 1000 uh, 1200 and 1220 megahertz I didn't touch the memory clock but that's what 1.35 volt I did and I uh, what would happen is that the as you can see the maximum temperature it reached was 85 degrees uh, that's what I recommend uh, setting the fan speed to uh, actually higher than 45 percent 50 percent or something like that 60 because if you leave it in auto you can actually hear it ramp up and uh, it will overheat uh, so I would suggest if you're going to crank the voltage uh, to 1.35 to the maximum and uh, I would suggest setting the fan speed uh, to a higher value although of course it will be much more audible now let us uh, let me just hit the reset here default and then we're going to move the fan speed uh, I'm going to be quiet and uh, I'm going to crank this fan speed uh, percent uh, in 20 in rather in 10% uh, increments until you can hear it. All right, so I'm right now start with 20%.
All right, as you might have heard, uh, all the way to 40%, it's barely audible at all. It can't hear anything, basically. And uh, once it reached 50%, that's when it became uh, much more noticeable. And of course, from 80% to 100%, it's the maximum speed where you can't really uh, uh, hear anything anymore. And uh, of course, we are, uh, let me just uh, show the other features of the GPU tweak utility while we're here. Uh, here at the left side, you have the uh, just a monitoring window. You can see the temperature. Shows the maximum and minimum in there. You have GPU usage, fan duty, control, memory voltage, uh, memory clock, memory usage, GPU clock. And here at the bottom you have the GPU info, which opens up the GPU Z. And you can see right there what kind of card we have. You have the Cape Verde, of course, AD7700 video card. Similar to GPU Z. And of course, uh, it has this own uh, skin that is. Uh, uh, that fits the ASUS GPU tweak color scheme, and uh, that's pretty much it. And uh, thanks for watching. You can read the rest of this review at uh, www.hitechlegion.com, or and subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtubecom legion to see more of our reviews.